Tech System for Literacy Accountability for Kindergarten through Third Grade is called the Dynamic Indicators of Early Basic Literacy Skills, or DIVLS. DIVLS is a curriculum-based measurement, one of the five forms of assessment for students with learning disabilities. In particular, DIVLS is valid. Children's scores on DIVLS are compared with scores on other similar literacy skills assessments. Also, DIVLS can predict students' future development in reading. However, not much attention is given to comprehension. DIVLS is also reliable. It is fairly straightforward and easy to administer, but students with different dialects than the test giver, like David, may have trouble being interpreted well by the test giver. Perhaps the most important quality of DIVLS is that it is sensitive to small incremental changes in student performance over time. What does DIVLS consist of? The following are short demonstrations of the six measures used in DIVLS. Each one has its own benchmark goal. The first is initial sounds fluency with a goal of 25 initial sounds per minute by mid-kindergarten. This is camel, turtle, shoulder, chick. Which picture begins with chick? Which picture begins with t? Which picture begins with sh? What sound does camel begin with? K. The second is letter naming fluency with a goal of the top 20th percentile by K1. Name as many upper and lower case letters as you can in one minute. If you do not know a letter, I will tell you the letter. You may begin. I, J, I, O, G, Y, W, X, U. Stop. The third is phonemic segmentation fluency with a goal of at least 35 phonemes per minute by kindergarten. I'm going to say a word. After I say it, you tell me all the sounds in the word. So if I say Sam, you would say s eh, mm. Let's try one. Let. La. Eh. T. How about bus. B. Us. Awesome. The fourth is nonsense word fluency, with the goal of at least 50 letter sounds per minute by mid-first grade. Look at this word. It's a make-believe word. Watch me read the word. S-I-M. Sim. I can say the sounds of the letters. S-I-M. Or I can read the whole word. Sim. Your turn to read a make-believe word. Here are some make-believe words. Start here, and when I say begin, read the words the best you can. Point to each letter and tell me the sound, or read the whole word. Read the words the best you can. Put your finger on the first word. Ready? Begin. That's right. The sounds are u, e, n, or lin. Can you tell me another word? M, a, s, mas. Very good. The next measurement is oral reading fluency, which involves a student reading a passage and recalling what was read. This has a benchmark goal of 40, 90, and 110 words read per minute by then the first, second, and third grades, respectively. Please read this out loud. If you get stuck, I will tell you the words so you can keep reading. When I say stop, I may ask you to tell me about what you read. So do your best reading. Start here. Begin. I heard a frog outside. It said, rivet, rivet. I went to see where it was. I looked under the porch. I looked under the car. I looked all around the backyard. I even looked in the garbage can, but I could not see a frog. I kept hearing the frog, so I sat on the porch and listened. When I heard it again, it sounded like it was so close. 
I could touch it. I looked all around me, but I still could not see a frog. I waited until the sun went down and the moon came up. I couldn't wait any longer because it was my bedtime. Stop. Please tell me all about what you just read. Try to tell me everything you can. Begin. I heard a frog outside, and it said, Ribbit, Ribbit. So I looked outside, but I couldn't see it. I looked and I looked, but I couldn't find anything, and so I had to go to bed, so I never found it. Very good. The last measurement of Dibbles is word use fluency. This has a goal of 50% fluency, and it involves the student using each word from a list correctly in a sentence. Listen to me use this word, green. The grass is green. Here is another word, jump. I like the jump rope. Your turn to use a word. Screamed. I threw a rock at him, and he screamed. Children who meet the benchmark goal for each measure have a greater than 80% chance of becoming proficient readers. Hold this like this. All right, all right, it's recording. Oh my gosh. Okay, hey. <laughs>